Hello everybody, welcome to another movie review. This time we are reviewing Assault on Precinct 13 from 1976. Gave this movie a rating of 8 and I saw it in 2014. I am a big fan of John Carpenter and the Alpha and Omega of his prime from 1976 to 1988 when he churned out four unforgettable classic pictures. There is something about in each one of them. A deliberate build up of tension, the slow movement of players as they get to their places, and the subsequent roller coaster ride. In short, Assault on Precinct 13 is the textbook of John Carpenter's formula. Interestingly, there is a great deal of similarities between Asphalt on Precinct 13 and Night of the Living Dead. If that's the case, then John was paying homage to George Romero by having Neil Hicks to appear instead of zombies. There are three stars of Assault on Precinct 13 that steal the show. Austin Stoker in a Dwayne Jones type of a role, Darwin Jostin and Laurie Zimmer. They all work together very well and there is a certain pronounced but not acted on sexual tension between Jostin's and Zimmer's characters. The plot is realistic as it gets, and that's what makes John Carpenter films very exciting to watch. Probably the only trade-off is the slow pace of the film, however, while this occurs during the most moiety, the next one more than makes up for it. All in all, Assault on Precinct 13 is the beginning of John Carpenter's cinema greatness. Thank you so much for watching my review. We'll see you all next time in another movie review. Thank you.